Hello and welcome to Nessa and Andy's Travels. Yes, we're back again. Yep, we are back again. And we're parked in the car park in the Peak Village Shopping Centre in Derbyshire. We've just had some lunch. And spent some money. Yeah, we didn't intend to spend money, but... No, but he, we had... You took me in the shoe shop and we went into some clothes shops and... Yes, we spent money. And we got a new... Another, yet another case, suitcase. <laughs> it's another. only a whole uh, a cabin bag. Yeah, one with four wheels. Which is a bit handier than having two wheels when you're getting through airport and onto the aircraft. I've not actually had a four wheel one myself, but we've had two wheels. Oh. Oh, we've got a duck and a moor in. All oh, the ducks sitting there. Sunning themselves. Oh, what did the ducks say? Huh? Never mind. <laughs> what? I think there's a song there somewhere. All the little ducks. No. <laughs> no. Not as far as I'm concerned. Oh, right. Okay. <laughs> Must have been a different childhood for you. Maybe. <laughs> I am so much yeah, younger we... than you. <laughs> Right, so we're coming out of the car park. Paw park. Car park. <laughs> uh, we're going to do a, a left. Which takes us towards Chatsworth House. My right, God, look at the mess here on the road from the rain from yesterday. Goodness me. Wow, it's washed all the sediment down. Yeah. Mm, it's a bit of a mess. It's a bit of a wide load on that bike. It is, isn't it? Yeah, there's a saying my mum used to say about that. What? I'm trying to think of it. <laughs> and I can't remember what it is she used to say. <laughs> Never mind, it might come to me just yeah, now. Yeah, possibly. Yeah. Push bikes and motor bikes. Just try and get past the man on the push bike and it's a busy old road this. I think to, you might struggle. Yeah, going to Chatsworth. It's, it's uh, quite busy coming back. It can't be very nice where they've been. No, it must be raining. There's a lot of them coming back. Mm. <laughs> and now you've got a bend. There you go, a bend. Oh, around the corner. Let's go, let's go, let's go, let's go. <laughs> Get the roar of the V8. Get oh past the man. dear. Man on the bike. <laughs> well, we started off with a beautiful clear blue sky from home this morning. It's clouding over a bit now. It is. Changed as the day has progressed. Still warm. It's actually 28 degrees on my dash. Yeah, but what is it outside? No idea. <laughs> Probably not 28. <laughs> you can never go by what's on the dash to be exact. But it gives a good guide. Mm. I need to stop trying to be funny. Right. <laughs> it doesn't often work. Oh, right. <laughs> I'd never make a comedian. A chameleon? Comedian. Oh, comedian. Oh, for goodness sake. There's some rocks tumbled down off of there. Something to do with the rain. Yeah. It's Beely Village to our left. Right. Right, sorry. <laughs> Why am I looking right and saying left? <laughs> Told you, I'm going to write it on the back of your hands, left and right. Yeah. Have it tattooed on. That's right. I know what it is, when I'm looking out across, and it's on my, I'm thinking about my left when I'm looking across, and it's actually on my right. That well, doesn't make sense. Well, well, it's my excuse. Oh, I wonder why we're going slow, more 
more posh bikes. Yeah. Such a nice day, you expect there's quite a few about. One coming the opposite direction as well. this man before we turn left for Chatsworth, or oh, there's two of them, because it's going to be very difficult after that mm. road gets quite narrow. Depends how good this guy in front is. Yeah. Because if they don't go past him, that's it, you're stuck. Yeah. Not easy with the traffic on the roads as they are anyway. No. We're getting very close to that. We should be alright. Mm. We won't get past them till after the bridge, I don't think. Chatsworth Estate to our left and to our right, huge area. I'll just forget the name of the river that we're going over now as well. Don't tell me on the na no, navigation. I, I just have a, I might be wrong, but I'm going to guess the Derwent, but I'm probably wrong. It is the Derwent. Oh look. I can confirm it is the Derwin. There we go, that was uh, the file in my brain worked. <laughs> and we're on Remember. the B six oh one two. And this chap's for uh, or this lady, I think it is, looking in the mirror. She's been following these for quite a while. Yeah, well the road's a bit It is a bit. Wig waggle, isn't it? got plenty of traffic coming in the opposite direction as well. Mm. Oh, she's going to the car park on our left. I got that very <laughs> left. <laughs> yeah, she's going to park up for the day. Going to have a picnic or whatever. Now it's down to me to get past her. Mm. Okay, here we go. No mercy. <laughs> now, are the deer about today? Probably too warm for them to be out. Yeah, there. they'll be out under the trees hiding. Yeah. Sheep are out hiding in the grass. Tea rooms to tea our room. 
rooms there. Mm. That's where the church is, where the tea rooms are. Yeah. All these lovely cottages. Look at that. That is gorgeous. All the roses in the garden. Mm. But it smells lovely there. I've only got one rose. I never used to like roses, but I'm, I'm, they're growing on me. <laughs> roses grow on you. Oh, dear. Oh, dear. Oh, that's showing me age. Yeah, that's right. <laughs> <laughs> oh, we've, got, we've got three rose plants in the garden. Yeah, two of them are wild, wild flower, wild roses, aren't yeah. they? Yeah. And then you've got. And then I've got my burnt orange one. Yeah. I don't mind getting more of the roses. Well, we know Rubbish they... at looking after them, but. Uh, yeah. <laughs> that was the thing. My mum used to have roses in the garden. She was forever sort of working on them, pruning them, and deadheading. Them. Yeah, it was a big garden of my mum. Whereas I just tend to put things in and let, let them get onto their own. Let it grow, and then <laughs> and then when they die, I put something else in. Yeah, <laughs> and then uh, somebody else is left to look after it most of the time. Uh, wild garden. Yes, it's certainly wild. At the moment it is. If I had my way it'd be even wilder and get rid of that lawn. It's wild enough. It takes some doing to keep enough up with all the nettles down the bottom as it is. And that wild patch we planted last year. <laughs> yeah, that's, that's gone. That's gone beyond wild. Yes. So that's what would happen if you got rid of the lawn and it didn't look like that. Full of clover. Yeah. <laughs> but the bees like it. It's good for the bees. Plenty of clover in there, plenty of dandelions. We're looking after our bees mm -hmm. and our butterflies. Plenty of lavender growing in there for them. Yeah. Nice here. Mm. <laughs> Be better without the traffic lights. Though. Yeah, it would, wouldn't it? <laughs> Here, take us straight to Sheffield. We're going to go left. It's all part of Baslow still. Lovely church on our left. Gorgeous church. Stuff. 
stone built dwellings. Yeah. Except these horrible pebble death ones on the left. Why would you pebble dash over that beautiful stone? That's a good question. So, it was all the rage at one time, wasn't it? Pebble dashing. Yeah. Bye for now.